Sylvester Stallone is an American screenwriter, director, and a producer. Above all, is a very successful actor. But do you really know how challenging a life he lived before becoming what he is today? When he was 26, he got nowhere to go. He owned only two pair of pants that barely fit, shoes that had holes in them, and the dreams of being successful were as far away as the sun. In 1971, he adapted a dog and named him Butkus. Both Stallone and Butkus lived in an apartment that was infested with roaches. Butkus was a best friend, his confidant, who always laughed at his jokes and put up with his moods and was the only living thing that loved him for who he really was. The dog stayed with him through hard times. They were inseparable friends. He was broke. His only option was to keep writing scripts. He couldn't even buy food for Buckers anymore, so he had to sell his dog for $40 just to buy food for him. And after selling the script for Rocky, the first thing that he did once he got the money was to look for Buckers. He found the dog in a liquor store. He had to visit the store more than once to find the man who had bought Buckers. The worst part was the man knew exactly how desperate Stallone was to get the dog back. Hence, he asked him $15,000 for the dog. Stallone did not even think twice and paid the money. That is 375 times more than the money he had been given. After that, Rocky won an Oscar. The two never separated and Butkus even got to star in the first two movies, Rocky and Rocky II. In 1981, the dog bit Stallone goodbye forever.